Hello everyone, the Godfather Dictator back with episode 36, Total Stealth Footprint of Phantoms. And I didn't upload a video in a couple of days, it's not because I ran out of content, it's because I was busy with other stuff. The first one being that they released Blade as a new hero and the only MMO that I'm playing, Marvel Heroes 2015. And well, I had to level him up <laughs> because I had him and he was pretty fun to play actually. Uh, second reason is because I applied for a close technical test of Battleborn, the new uh, 2k game that's going to be released i guess next year or maybe later this year i don't know exactly i didn't check the release date but i cannot talk about it into detail because when i applied for that they they tell you like you won't record gameplay or you won't talk about it so the only thing i will say about this game is that for a beta it looks pretty damn promising and i know i've heard like some mixed opinion about the game some people complain that 2k can only do games that are similar to borderland but honestly like who cares when you have a recipe that work why would you change to take a chance to do something that will end up being crap you know like stay with what you know and do what you do best another thing why i'm doing this video right now well of course it's for you guys i'm uploading the video for you guys but I want to take the, ta the time, the tame, what the fuck is that? I want to take the time to talk about something important is because I will be asking, and that can be pretty much anyone, but I will have a couple of, of criteria for that. I will be asking in this video if you want an application to be my next gaming partner. And when I say next gaming partner is my my main gaming partner, my primary gaming partner that I would play with well most of the time and why uh, i'm saying this now is because my previous main gaming partner and i call him previous main gaming partner because he was my partner for like over i think six seven years until he got in fucking destiny and now he's totally addicted to that and i can't seem to get him out of there and that's kind of a shame because like i got into a lot of game a lot but never that i like couldn't control my body to stop playing a game if you get what i mean like destiny may be fun i like i only played the demo it may be extremely fun extremely addicting but i i don't understand like people that can't take like one hour off a game to play with their supposedly gaming partner and me that's the problem there is because i need someone that i can rely on like all the time not someone that will play with me when he wants to, you know, because, yeah, it, it, like, it, it won't work if it's someone like that, and that's what's happening right now, like, uh, I, I'm trying to get him into different game, he even got Metal Gear Solid, and I played multiplayer one time with him, you know, and he, like, after that, he went back to Destiny, and he's been stuck to Destiny, so that's kind of really disappointing, so that's why I'm doing this right now, and I will be asking, well, pretty much anyone but before you like message me in the comment below say hey i want to be your next gaming partner i will tell you three criteria because if i don't do criteria okay for my next gaming partner there's too much people who will apply and well i don't want too much people to apply to be honest because i will feel bad if i choose someone and then it's it's like it's not the other people basically and they will say why you choose this person over me and you didn't and like you didn't ask for any criteria so that's why i will ask for criteria the first one that's like really important but it's really easy is that you gotta speak english or french if you don't speak those language you probably don't even understand what i'm saying right now so there's no point to apply for this position <laughs> uh, second one and that's where I know a lot of people won't actually apply for, to be honest, it's not a job, but it would be some kind of job anyway, apply for the position, is that you need to have at least one no damage project done on your channel on video. I need a video proof. Someone that tell me did a game no damage it may be possible, but if I don't have the video proof of it, I won't believe you. So, also, 
want to mention it needs to be for a game that's remotely hard and when i say remotely hard i will give you an example it's not hard ninja gaiden hard but it will be hard like batman hard you know so just to give you an idea don't bring me i don't know a a sim game telling me that you do no damage at building a fucking city like i don't care and this this won't work i'm i'm telling you right away if someone send me that stupid shit yeah i i won't even consider you the third criteria being that you need to be available a lot and you need like to get used to my weird gaming habit and when i say weird gaming habit is because sometimes i will for example play a game for 30 minutes and then i will go watch something on tv for 20 minutes and come back to play after so i need someone that's patient because this if it's someone that's impatient and always want me to be there for like hours in a row and non-stop it won't work another thing is i don't care about like your age you know to be honest because like i've seen some 15 years old that were like more mature than 40 years old so i don't care like how old you are but the only thing is that i really cannot handle someone that's totally immature and that will keep asking me all the time like can we play now can we play now because if for example i choose someone and it end up being like this like i'm telling you i'm just gonna block you and i'm gonna find another gaming partner it will be uh, like that simple because I can tolerate some joke and all that crap, but I like I won't tolerate uh, annoying behavior and yeah, someone that keeps bothering me all the time. You can ask me if I want to play, but then if you say don't reply, like don't send me ten message after that. And what are you doing? What are you doing? And like yeah, that that won't work. So after it's like saying all this, I know a couple of people that would fit. Uh, the description perfectly for uh, for this uh, this job if you want but uh, I know some of them for example uh, where are the pube okay where are the pube could of course apply but I know that he got a child a while ago and now he's barely uploading video you know so I cannot ask him to play with me like when he had no children and anything like that that won't happen another one that could apply that I know of is Lord Gamal but Lord Gamal to apply would need to get out of his comfort zone to play a multiplayer game with me because he's been playing like a lot of Devil May Cry and Ninja Gaiden Sigma at the time. So I know he's a really good player. But yeah, if you would apply for this, you would have to play with me, bro. <laughs> so you'd have no choice to get out of your comfort zone in terms of gaming. So after saying all of that, if you're interested and you meet the criteria that I asked for, well, send me a comment below. And tell me, hey, uh, I would be interested in being uh, like your main gaming partner. And of course, that will come with perks if I choose you. And I will talk to you about it personally when I choose the person, the specific person. And if we don't have anyone for a while, that's okay. I mean, I won't pick the first person that sent me a comment, except if it's for a person that like really surprised me in terms of skill and all that stuff. So we'll see about that and I hope you enjoyed that video as usual guys and I will catch you up later on another mission. Peace out.